Hey everybody, this is a Jordan here, and today we're going to release the first and second event for the Iron Flash 2017 for our teams division. The format is very similar to our individuals. Teams for event one, teams will have six minutes to establish a one rep max clean and a three rep max front squat. So the way this is going to work, partner one will establish a one rep max clean. For RX divisions, you're required to perform a squat clean. For scale divisions, you can either power or squat clean. Partner two will establish a three rep max front squat. For all divisions, the athlete can either power clean it or squat clean. It does not matter. However, if the athlete chooses to squat clean, they must stand up, show lockout, and then they can begin their first, or then they can begin their three reps. So again, the first rep, does, if the first squat clean does not count towards the three rep max front squat, and that goes for all divisions. Once the six minutes is up, Hey everybody, uh, Jordan here, and today we're going to uh, release the first and second team events for the 2017 Iron Clash. For event one, teams will have six minutes to establish. Partner one will establish a one rep max clean, and partner two will establish a three rep max front squat. For RX divisions, you must perform a squat clean, and for scale divisions, you can either power clean or squat clean. For male, male, female, female teams, you will have one barbell, and for co-ed teams, you will have two barbells. For the three rep max front squat, you can choose to power clean or squat clean to get the bar up into the front rack position. However, if you choose to squat clean, you must stand all the way up, show lockout, and then you can begin your three reps. Again, the first squat clean does not count towards your three rep max front squat. And we'll go over more of that in details when we release the movement standard video later this week. Once the six minutes are, or once the six minutes are up, teams will rest two minutes and they will go immediately into event number two, which is a seven minute air map of five calories on the soft bike and five box jump overs. The standard is the same across all divisions, 24 inches for all males, 20 inches for all females. The way this is going to work is partner one will complete a full round of five calories on the assault bike and five box jump overs. Then partner two will go and partner two will complete five calories on the assault bike and five box jump overs. And teams will continue alternating rounds for the seven minutes. So partner one will take all odd, odd, odd number rounds and partner two will take all even number rounds. Make sure you guys uh, stay tuned because we will release the movement standard video for team event one and two later this week. And make sure that you guys are following us on the Iron Clash Facebook page as well as the Iron Clash Instagram page. Uh, we'll be releasing another workout within the next 10 days. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Also, we're gonna be having a few announcements uh, concerning the Clash um, in the next 10 to 14 days, so make sure you guys are staying tuned uh, on those Facebook and Instagram uh, social media outlets for any updates concerning the clash.